Good evening and welcome to Night Prayer on this Monday the 14th of February 2022. My name is Reverend Joe Richards and I'm rector here in Canterbury of our benefice of St Dunstan, St Mildred's and St Peter's. And tonight's icon is that of my um, the Archangel Michael. So that's the Archangel Michael we have there this evening. And it's a very cold and wet night so as we gather together let us pray. The Lord Almighty, grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. We say together, Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life. In Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. We say together our night hymn. Before the ending of the day, creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. From evil dreams defend our sight, from fears and terrors of the night. Tread underfoot our deadly foe, that we no sinful thought may know. O Father, that we ask be done through Jesus Christ, your only Son, and Holy Spirit, by whose breath our souls are raised to life from death. Our appointed psalm for this evening is Psalm 4. In peace I will lie down and sleep. Answer me when I call, O God of my righteousness. You set me at liberty when I was in trouble. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. How long will you nobles dishonour my glory? How long will you love vain things and seek after falsehood? But know that the Lord has shown me his marvellous kindness. When I call upon the Lord, he will hear me. Stand in awe and sin not. Commune with your own heart upon your bed and be still. Offer the sacrifices of righteousness and put your trust in the Lord. There are many that say, who will show us any good? Lord, lift up the light of your countenance upon us. You have put gladness in my heart more than when their corn and wine and oil increase. In peace I will lie down and sleep, for it is you, Lord, only who make me dwell in safety. In peace I will lie down and sleep. Give us today, O God, a glad heart and a clear conscience, that when we come to this day's end, we may rest in peace with Christ our Lord. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Thus says the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, In returning and rest you shall be saved, in quietness and in trust shall be your strength. That was some words from scriptures from Isaiah 30, verse 15. And now for our responsory. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. And now for the Nunc Dimittis. Save us, O Lord, while waking and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. Mine own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations, and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, 
that awake we may watch with Christ and asleep may rest in peace. Let us pray. So Heavenly Father, we give thanks for the day that has been so far. Perhaps people we've met, conversations we've had. This is a chance to give thanks for all that has been as we look back upon the day. It's times that have brought a smile to our face or maybe a challenge. We give thanks for all that has been this day. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And we pray for those who perhaps fear this night with trepidation and anxiety. For those who perhaps particularly feeling on their own, lonely, perhaps without a loved one. Whatever this night holds, Lord, we pray that you are with us and close to us in all that we are and all that we do. We remain ever mindful of those who are perhaps not well this evening. For those who are in hospital, perhaps recovering from surgery or illness. For those who spend this night at a bedside. We pray particularly for those who are working this evening. In this cold, wet night. We pray for our emergency services. Those who work in our hospitals, care homes in our hospice, work in our supermarkets, stacking the shelves, the truck drivers, work in the post office, our night economy, remaining ever mindful of so many who work so hard. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And we just pray for those known to us who asked us for prayer this evening. We pray for peace at this time, peace in our world. Pray particularly this night for the people of the Ukraine and Russia, that peace may prevail there. So, Heavenly Father, accept our prayers for the sake of your Son, our Saviour, Jesus Christ. Amen. The Collect for tonight. Be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the silent hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of this fleeting world may rest upon your eternal changelessness through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. We say together the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. In peace we will lie down and sleep, for you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. Thank you for joining us this evening for night prayer. Wherever you may be, have a peaceful night and do join us if you can for morning prayer at nine. Otherwise, we will see you again at six. Good night and God bless. Bye for now. Bye.